She comes home, fishes her COVID test out of the trash can. Oh, I thought that meant I was fine. I thought it was allergies. My m- bitch mother be tripping. Yeah. <laughs> bitch be tripping, blonde moment story, whatever you want to call it. We had a lot of fun with these calls last time. We're going to get your phones lined up, your calls, your stories. 877-44-WOODY. We just uh, opened up all the lines, and they're ready to go for you to call in. Like uh, somebody said, my girlfriend and I had a heated debate about whether or not dinosaurs were alive during the American Revolution. Her stance was, there's no way to know. Bitch be tripping. (laughs) There's many ways to know. Well, because there's a lot of fake photos that get shared on Facebook. Yeah. And a lot of people... Uh, this one says, my friend spit out gum on the sidewalk and said, don't worry, it'll evaporate. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, little, be tripping. It's not, it's not water. What are all those little black smudges all over the sidewalk? Yeah, yeah. evaporate. It's, That's why it's not a big gloop anymore. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> all right, so yeah, if you got a good story, like my wife took my son to, I told you, the Apple store, and this was like the day after the, uh, the Microsoft. Microsoft thing. Yeah. What was the name of that? CrowdStrike or something like that? Right. Anyway. Where they had that big thing and everybody, all the airlines were jacked up right. and everything else. Uh, anyway, so she walks in there and she's making small talk with the people at the Genius Bar and she goes, so how bad was everything yesterday? <laughs> it's like it's a window. It's a Microsoft thing. It's not Apple. It's like, we're it's fine. Like, yeah, mm-hmm. it's like asking Coke if they were affected by the Pepsi problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And uh, she told me that my son was laughing his ass off. He's like, mom. Bruh. Mom. Bruh. Yeah. Yeah. So embarrassing. <laughs> Bitch be tripping. Yeah. So if uh, you said something, you did something, you couldn't believe it the moment it escaped your mouth, the minute that you did it, you're like, oh my God, how stupid. How dumb of me. Yeah. Bitch be tripping. It's like when Greg uh, got the new credit card in the mail. Oh, speaking of uh-huh. which, so when I get, yeah, this happened more than once where I get the new card in the mail and then I take the old one out, and then I cut up the new one, and I go, oh, oh crap. No. Right, bitch be true. I just cut up the new one. <laughs> yeah, Sammy stupid. witnessed uh, something similar to that. Every day, Woody, I have your little informational sheets in front of you that I tape up, and I update them every day. And I took the new, the brand new ones that I just printed for the following day for you, and then I take the old ones, set them aside, take the new ones, throw those away, tape up the old <laughs> ones again. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, oh, I just did the debit card I know. thing. <laughs> All right, bitch be tripping. Blonde moment stories. Anybody uh, in the room have one to well, share? Well, I told you this week my mind was blown when, and then I've watched all these movies that uh, Pitch Perfect. Oh, yeah. That was the actual <laughs> name of the movie, not Picture Perfect, which I have thought it was Picture Perfect this whole time. Or even Picture. Yeah. Yeah. Who knew it was picture pitch per- perfect? I mean, that pitch perfect obviously makes yeah. way more sense it than does. That. picture perfect. All those photography <laughs> students, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but but yeah. who knew? Who knew? Right. Who knew? It's a mystery. All right, uh, <laughs> bitch be tripping 877 Woody. You can hit us up with a text over to 22987. And uh, let's see what we got here. We have uh, some people on the phones, and we're gonna go right to. Uh, Kat. Hey, good morning, Kat. How are you? Good morning. How are you guys? We're doing fantastic. All right, so uh, your bitch be tripping blonde moment. What do you got? Yeah, so I work for a design and build firm, and we have a cabinet supplier in California. Um, And we, the girl didn't hear back from them for about a day. And she asked me if it was yesterday in California (laughs) and if that was why she didn't hear back from them. And it was, it got so bad. I was like, girl, it's three hours. And she said, I'm going to Google it. It was ridiculous. Oh my, it was the best. Is it Uh, yesterday? (laughs) Yeah. 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 Unless California moved to China, that's not. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Bitches be crazy. Yeah. All right, so good. That's a great story. Thank you so much for sharing. Thank Appreciate you. you listening to Woody Shaw. It's like, bye. 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 I love uh, that one. Let's go to uh, Catherine. Hey, good morning, Catherine. Good morning. How are you guys doing? Good. We're doing good. great. All right, so uh, what's your bitch be tripping blonde moment story? Well, it's not only a bitch be tripping. It is also a very embarrassing moment. So I had a huge water bed, and I'm talking huge. It had mirrors on the top. I called it the nice. free bed, Okay. So I'm moving, and I book these movers. They come in. We take the bed apart. Everything's great, wonderful. We get it to the new house. We have all these pieces, all this stuff on the floor. And I looked at both of the guys, and I said, okay, boys, let's get to screwing. Yeah. <laughs> and then I stop for a second, and I go, 
oh my god the bed and they were dying and i'm sure their brains went really south at that moment but that was a super dumb moment <laughs> yeah, <all right. laughs> they got excited for a second oh, though for sure. yeah, I know. they were really happy for a minute yes yeah. it's the bitches be tripping all the time bitch be tripping all the time huh? all right Catherine. Oh. thank you for the call yes. appreciate listening to the woody show like bye, bye. 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 All right, bye. Uh, let's see. We got some people on the text, 22987. It was mid-January. I was in the checkout line at the Walmart. This uh, older lady was like, uh, good morning. Happy holidays. I guess I look confused since it was past Christmas. And she goes, it's the king's birthday. This bitch, me, said, Elvis? And the woman looked at me with disgust. Uh, this one, 562, I asked my sister one time what SUV stood for, and she said super ultra vehicle. Oh, damn it. We no. could have asked Menace. Uh, yeah. Well, what does it stand for? Uh, super all-terrain vehicle. Mm. SUV? Anybody? Sammy? I got it. Sub all-terrain vehicle? Sub all-terrain. All-terrain? Ultra rain. Ultra rain. Ultra rain. Ultra rain. All right. Uh, <sighs> Morgan, let's ask you. Oh, Morgan, yeah, what does SUV stand for? Oh, God. Um, <laughs> sub ultra vehicle? <laughs> Utility vehicle? Yeah, huh? that's good. Okay, okay. okay. That's warmer. Warmer. You, got, you got two. What's the okay. first one, though? Yeah, what's Ooh. the S? Submissive. Submissive. Yes. Yeah, very submissive. submissive. Superior. Menace. Ooh. Come on, dog. Oh, I thought that was a good guess. Oh, thank you. Is it sub? sub no. no. Don't know. So what, would, what would it be sub of? Okay. We, we, Suburban? <laughs> yeah. Sport. I mean, that's not wrong. Sport oh. utility oh. vehicle. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nice. yeah. 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 now that you mention it, I've heard oh, that. Yeah. Yeah. Bitches be crazy. I need to have my coffee. What does SAV stand for? What is S A V in re re reference to what, Greg? In, yeah. in reference to a vehicle. Oh, oh uh, all terrain vehicle. <laughs> Activity. Activity. Ah. Okay. What about a UTV? <laughs> what about a UTI? What about Law and Order S V U? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, sexual... I know that one. No. Special Go ahead. Victims Unit. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah What'd nice. you say? Special Victims. Oh okay. Yeah, yeah. not Sexual Victims. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. uh, Five one two says I was walking into an elevator while on my phone. I noticed the doors had closed, but confused as to why the elevator wasn't moving. After a moment, I started to panic. Even thought I uh, maybe have died, but then I realized I just never pressed the button to the floor I needed to go. Bitch, uh, be tripping. Yeah. yeah, you thought you like died. You. Yeah. yeah. Eight seven seven forty four Woody. That's eight seven seven forty four Woody. Gina Grab, what do you got? So we uh, we went to visit my mom not too long ago, and she was sneezing and sounded horrible and said she had allergies. And I was like, eh, this sounds like COVID. I don't have COVID. I don't have COVID. I'm like, okay, I'm just, <laughs> just an allergies. Okay, everybody says that. She comes home, fishes her COVID test out of the trash can, slams it in front of me, and is like, see? And I go, yeah, I see two lines. You have COVID. I thought that meant I was fine. I thought it was allergies. My m bitch mother be tripping. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, read the directions. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, what does it say there? All right. Uh, what about you, Sammy? I <laughs> I had a friend who got into the fire department, and our other friend is actually a guy. Ha he was like, yeah, so if you get an ember alert, call this guy. And we were like, oh, my God, great joke. That's hilarious. He was dead serious. He was like, no, the ember alerts that you get on your phone. And we were like, you mean the Amber alerts for children <laughs> that get abducted. And he's like, oh, I thought that was for fires. <laughs> oh, wow. Why should I like have fires in a blue SUV? Yeah. <laughs> that is north. They should have Ember alerts. Wow. Right? Screw that. Maybe they do. Idea. Yeah, it's not confusing at all. Uh, yeah. In the movie Seven, everyone dies for committing one of these seven deadly sins. In the scene where you see the word gluttony written on the wall, my sister said, ooh, gluten. <laughs> it <laughs> is very <laughs> sinful. <laughs> Bitch gluten. be tripping. Uh, 877-44. Woody, text over to 22987. Uh, somebody said when they were in college, they're on the phone with their mom. They saw a rainbow, and they asked their mom if she could see it. She lived two hours away. <laughs> All right. Mm. Oh. Bitch, be <laughs> tripping. Uh, anybody else in the room before I go to some of these other ones? Uh, just throwing away brand new things that I printed out. Okay, yeah. All right. <laughs> uh, how about this one? She doesn't do it now, but my wife used Tide Pods by ripping them open and pouring them into the <laughs> washing oh, machine. Yeah, no. <laughs> I guarantee she's not the only one. Yeah. Uh, all right, my boyfriend thought that Harriet Tubman was a railroad conductor and the <gasps> Underground Railroad was literally underground. Oh, wow. Uh, this is an adult. Bitch, be tripping. Uh, a guy thought his car was stolen. Turned out he had driven it across the street to buy a soda, walked home, and forgot that he moved it. Whoops. 
uh, bitch be tripping. But have you ever looked for something while you're holding it? Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, I've looked for glasses absolutely. while wearing it. Oh, your yeah. phone's in your pocket and you're looking yeah. all over for it. Using uh, your glasses to find your glasses? Here's one. It says, uh, my husband was doing some minor electrical work in our house. He told me the wire was hot. And I asked him how long it would take to cool down. Bitch be tripping. <laughs> Uh, I asked my boyfriend to get me a can of gas for the lawnmower, my electric lawnmower. <laughs> I literally like face palmed as it came out of my mouth. I just remembered one of my favorite Woody Bitch Be Trippin' stories. Oh, yeah? Oh, wow. When we were at a crowded, dark restaurant and somebody asked Woody if he knew what time it was. So he reaches into his pocket, takes out his phone, puts his thumb on it so he can get some yeah. light and aims it at his yeah. watch. <laughs> right. That's amazing. And I said, you know, yeah. you could have just looked at your I phone. Know. <laughs> Bitch be tripping. <laughs> that you just yeah. took out of my your My first instinct is to always look at my watch. Yeah, That's hilarious. Yeah. That's like a dad move. Oh, yeah. Uh, this one says, uh, my mom and I went to Rent-A-Center and we get a washer and dryer set. Nice. We were looking at a set that sat next to each other. Uh, you know, the top loader and the side loader, traditional washer and dryer. We needed a stackable washer and dryer. She was wondering, can I stack these? I told her, no, it's not the same kind. <laughs> She insisted that she was going to ask the employee. So she flagged down an employee, oh, asked God. the question, do these stack? The employee looked at her puzzled. No, ma'am. These do not stack. Yeah. <laughs> Bitch uh, be tripping. Can't open it. Yeah. <laughs> 877 Woody. Text over to 22987. Uh, <laughs> this one says, uh, this guy claimed that he uh, couldn't get his girlfriend pregnant while she was on antibiotics. Oh, no. As a matter of fact, isn't it if you're on birth control, antibiotics can uh, be weakened? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Or can weaken that, the effect of the oh. birth control? Yeah, you can for sure get pregnant if you take antibiotics yeah. when you're on birth control. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, let's see. My brother asked when I got pregnant if he was going to be an aunt or an uncle. That's a good one. Uh, I guess he thought it mattered if it was a boy or a girl. Right. Bitch be tripping. Yeah, this segment is amazing. Makes me feel so much better about being a dumbass. <laughs> I went to Italy for a honeymoon with my first wife, horrified by an American tourist who thought that a waiter would understand her explaining that she was on vacation if she spoke very loudly and slowly. Do you understand vacation? Everybody I, does that. I mean, that's not wrong, though. <laughs> That's the, number, that's the number one problem I have when people are speaking in other languages and they speak too fast. And you, like, but if they spoke more slowly, I might understand yeah. that. And yelled. And yeah, louder. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yell at yeah. me a little bit. Did you ever shoplift? Yes. yes. Yeah, as a kid. Mm -hmm. As a kid, as yeah. As a kid. Yeah. I would as never, an adult, no. I would never dream of doing it as an adult. Oh, and inadvertently. Inadvertently. Yeah, I did it on accident uh, as an adult, as a kid on purpose. Yeah, I did go back, though. Oh, when you had guild. something under the cart? No, right. I was at a Best Buy and I was buying a computer bag and I had it was a backpack. So I had it yeah. on my shoulder uh -huh. and I had mm -hmm. all the other stuff that I was checking out with and I was just doing my thing, paid for everything and I left. And this is a time mm -hmm. that I was carrying a bag around a lot, you know, because I was like walking. It was right. like a walkable area of mm -hmm. my neighborhood and uh, didn't think mm -hmm. about it until I got to the, uh, to, the, to the apartment and I'm <gasps> putting everything down. I'm like, oh my God, I think I've had this thing on my shoulder the entire time. Looked at the receipt, sure as hell. <gasps> didn't have it on there so I walked back to the Best Buy oh, wow. and uh, and wow. paid for it but Best Buy has this, the guy right there and he didn't catch you yeah. no he didn't mark your receipt no no nope. just stood there at the cashier while they're you know scanning my stuff and asking me if I have the stupid club card or whatever the hell it is <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> the Best Buy card Damn. Yeah. yeah. As a kid, you kind of pilfer some stuff from the farmer's market, you know, on your own. But I, as an adult, I would just feel like a loser. Totally. Yeah. The farmer's market. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. You just grab yeah, a couple, of, yeah. <laughs> couple no, of cherries. It's called grazing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. As an adult, but, oh, I oh. accidentally stole a Mary Kay and Ashley DVD <laughs> that had like. <laughs> as an adult. Why was it in your as hand? As an adult. Because it was in the front by my purse because I took a picture of it because it had like four different movies. It's like Holiday in the Sun and Billboard Dad and all the good ones. Really? And I <laughs> All the good ones. Right. So I took a picture of it to send to my sister to be like, our Friday night's writing itself. And then it wasn't in the same area of the cart. And I was like, oh. Oh my God, I just sold a Mary Kate and Ashley DVD. <laughs> they were probably like, you know what? Keep it. That's our gift. <laughs> so 23% of adults say they have shoplifted, and about one in 20 have done it within the last year. Ooh, wow. That's pathetic. More than half of those who shoplifted were older than 16, but uh, shoplifters are hiding items on their body, purse, bags. Or just walk right out of the store. I mean, yeah. that's what people do now. Oh, Nowadays, uh -huh. you don't have to hide Very. anything. Yeah, as far as why they do it, nearly all of the recent shoplifters say they steal because inflation what? and the current <laughs> right. economy. Yeah, it's not my fault.
a third shoplift because they can't afford the prices. 30% do it to help make ends meet. (laughs) And 27% say they steal to save a few bucks. Hey, at least they're honest. They're more likely to steal from big chain stores than the small mom and pop shops. They say it's uh, easiest to get away with in grocery stores, department stores, and convenience stores. The most commonly stolen items are food and non-alcoholic drinks, followed by clothing, accessories, makeup, and cosmetics. 52% of shoplifters have uh, gotten away with it, but 48 have been, uh, been caught in the act. And after being busted, 33% only got a warning, 24% arrested, 22% banned from life. Wow. Oh, damn. Or banned for life from the store. <laughs> They've been yeah. killed. Yeah, they were killed. <laughs> That'd be cool. Yeah. Yeah, you are banned from life. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're and then, dead. Here we go. This is my uh, this is my thing. Forty one percent have accidentally taken something without paying for it, and half of them felt guilty. Thirty two percent embarrassed, but fifty one percent didn't bring it back to pay for it or well, return yeah, I was it. Say, if you oh, feel yeah. guilty, go back and pay for it. Yeah, just yeah, bring it. Just brings it. it back. Yeah, there's yeah. a way to handle that. Yeah, mm-hmm. I man, I felt like such a douche. Yeah, <laughs> and nobody in. said anything. No, they're like, oh no, we would just really appreciate you coming back. Bitch be tripping from the text. Uh, this one says, I lost my phone in my car. I couldn't find it anywhere. It was at night, so I used my phone's light to look for it. Sure. Five minutes later, I realized it was in my hand, and I was using it to look for my phone. Isn't that weird when that happens? Bitch be tripping. It's almost like you're hypnotized. Yeah. Well, it's like... Because I've literally looked for keys while holding them. Yeah. yeah. It, it's kind of the same thing as my watch thing. I'm so used to looking at my watch like, oh, let me see what time... Yeah. I, of course, the time's <laughs> right there on the stupid phone. <laughs> right. It's so weird. dumb. So dumb. Uh, this one says, one day while driving uh, with my girlfriend, we were listening to some music. Night Moves by Bob Seger came on. She said, oh, this is the guy from Full House. <laughs> <laughs> All right. uh, nice. I laughed so hard I had to pull over to avoid crashing That's great uh, This one said I was uh, making stew I was peeling my carrots and potatoes When I realized that I threw away the carrots And the potatoes while the shreds Were in the boiling water mm, Delicious shreds <laughs> That's just a different way to do it you yeah. know. It's just a different uh, delivery uh, My bitch be tripping is when people use the remotes to lock the car and literally hit the button compulsively like 10 times. That's me. Uh-huh. The explanation. So it's locked extra mm-hmm. just in case the first nine times don't work. Well, and bitch be tripping. And it shows nearby thieves. You better watch out. Yeah. Do you see those protected. lights flash? Yeah. I have Viper. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> bitch be tripping story in the news. A woman in Florida was hanging out with her boyfriend and she uh, tried to initiate some sexy time, some physical intimacy, mm-hmm. but the dude just wasn't interested. And then she got rejected again the next morning when she tried to cuddle with him. And that's when she snapped. She yanked him by the chest hair, scratched his face, broke his phone, and then bit him on the forehead. Oh, Jeez. my. She was arrested and taken to jail. Guess how old she is, by the way? 22 years old. Oh, okay. Whoa. Sounds about right. Right future. Sounds about right. Bitch, be tripping. Woman in Minnesota, a landlord, got into an argument with one of her uh, tenants and threw a live tarantula, Greg. Oh, God. At the tenants. She had uh, rented through one of the short term rental services, but when the renter's contract was up, they refused to leave. That's when she snapped, got into the argument, and threw the live tarantula along with a bunch of other junk. Good. At the renter. Yeah. Okay. Now I support it. <laughs> the uh, cops were called. She was arrested for assault. I heard. And. She- it uh, really screwed herself because she was a candidate for the county board. Oh, gee. Uh, she's still running, and let's not forget that she once set up a fake grinder account for an old boyfriend of hers. <laughs> I <laughs> love oh, this yeah. one. And stole, <laughs> and stole $80,000 from an old dentist boyfriend of hers. Oh. Yeah. This is the same chick? She's yeah. A, that's a tarantula girl, yes. Yeah. We did a whole local oh, news story. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's yeah. right. Simonetti or whatever. Oh, uh-huh. yeah. Diabolical. Yeah. I still follow. She has oh. uh, just a smoking hot pot. But yeah. Yeah, she's the one with the fake boobs. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> she's, the, yeah, she, po- she's the one with the proportionate body. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she's like yeah. that crazy, like dark eye, dark hair. Yeah. Simonetti. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Roommate tarantula. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, now the clips are in there. Oh, it's under yeah, local news. Go to roommate tarantula. Yeah, I did. Today in local news, but all the all the uh, all the files are gone. What inside? It's an empty folder. <gasps> oh no! No! Yeah, we've been hacked. Oh, there's two folders in here. Maybe the other one. Oh, there we go. Ah, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's the uh, here's the prior charges. Uh. Simonetti, who was the runner up in this summer's special election, has faced a number of allegations <laughs> in criminal and civil court. She was charged with credit card fraud for more than eighty thousand dollars worth of charges on her ex fiance's credit card, but that was dropped when the embattled former Woodbury dentist settled with Simonetti in civil court. <laughs> Another ex boyfriend, the father of Simonetti's child, currently has a harassment restraining order against her. Court papers show allegations of assault, and he accuses Simonetti of creating a phony grinder account using. <laughs> his name and photo, and messaging several men who then showed up at his house expecting to hook up. That's just hilarious. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there you go. Bitch be What's tripping. wrong with that? Yeah. You know there's t-shirts that say tarantula tosser with her name underneath Wow, it. that's cool. Yeah. Oh, she's leaning into it big time. Yeah. Uh, workers in China, they were demoing an old house. They called the bomb squad when they found a live grenade because the uh, 90-year-old woman who lived in the house found it in a field a while back, and she'd been using it, Greg, as a hammer. Oh, for the last Smart. 20 years. <laughs> she told the police she was using it to hammer nails and also as a uh, nutcracker. Fun. She had used nice. it so much over the last two decades, the metal head at the end was full of dents. They say they were able to uh, safely detonate the device and uh, no one was hurt. God forbid All you right. just buy a hammer. Bitch, yeah. be tri- but you got this perfectly good grenade, you know? Yeah. <laughs> use that. Why would you use anything else? The Woody Show will be right back.